Kachar Bas Shalom. My name is Saki Rosenfeld. I'm the owner of the Rosenfeld Gallery, which is a second, I'm a second generation as a gallerist. My father opened the gallery in the beginning of the 50s. And in 2000, we changed the gallery to strictly contemporary. And three years ago, to move, we moved from Dizengoff Street to the lower part of Tel Aviv. The exhibition we are having now is by Boaz Arad, a leading Israeli artist. And he called the exhibition Susita. Susita actually is one of the Israeli myths. Susita was the first car that Israeli actually made in the, in the 60s. This car, which is the Israeli crowd, was made out of fiberglass, which made the ability to build a car in those times. Uh, you know, as a myth, there is a, there is a story that actually came in in the Negev ate uh, the fiberglass of the car which was made of. And this is actually a real story that everybody that you told him about Susita will know about it. So actually the exhibition is talking about Israeli myths. The, set, the first one that you can see is actually this installation that you see in front of you, which is actually the emblem of, the, of Israel. This is actually the menorah with two olive oils that symbolize the nation of Israel. It is made out of the most simple material that you can find in the market and actually has a lot of layers for the symbols. The second image that we can see is actually a, a classroom that after school the children have the, turned the table upside down and usually you find under the table chewing gums, but here the children made out of the chewing gum a sculpture of Ben-Gurion, who was the first Prime Minister of Israel, and it is well known that he was going to the seashore, to the beach, to make yoga training. And there is a very famous photograph of Ben-Gurion in the same position. So actually, Boaz is, is talking about the idea that children can make the Prime Minister even more interesting and more fulfilling than uh, usually a teacher. But overall, we can understand that he had to chew a lot of chewing gums to make this uh, sculpture. The other installation that we can see called the Humus, or as you say, the Humus, in installation, this uh, uh, painting, let's say, is a ready-made Boaz Arad, the artist, found it on the street, thrown out from a local uh, from a local restaurant. This is the price list of the of the of the local simple uh, restaurant, and on a simple table from the 60s, he made a, a casting of a hummus plate with his own face inside the hummus. And it has, ha and it has seven uh, hummus beans, like the seven stars of Herzl. This culture is actually the donkey of the Messiah, which is white. And the donkey has many symbols in every culture. But here what, what Boaz did, he actually made the tail of the Messiah donkey as a plant called the Wandering Jew. Then, uh, if we are going back to the first myth that we were talking about, the Susita, actually this culture was called the Susita by the artist. It is made from the same fiberglass material as the green Susita was made. It is looked like the inside of the Susita because in the, in the car you could see the fiberglass when you went into the car. The mountain, uh, here is the Israeli crowd and this is the way that the Susita was looked from the outside. Actually, Susita is not only a car, it is also a mountain in Israel, which is in the Galilee. So the artist made a mountain, which is not really the Susita mountain, 
And it is not really a car, but it has a dimension that can contain a family like a family car. And this is the rest of the session. Thank you very much, and shalom.